What is up, Quadratics? In this video, we'll be talking about this week's Triple Money Event Week, as well as the property and vehicle discounts. This event week is for June 18th through June 24th, 2020. The current casino podium vehicle is the Ocelot R88. This car is in the open wheels class, where there are currently only two raceable F1 cars. And this one's primarily based on the Lotus 97T. It released about four months ago with the Casino Heist update and normally costs about $3 million. The two F1 cars in this game, the PR4 and the R88, are extremely fast cars in general. They handle like nothing else in the game, plus they have incredible physics I'm sure most of you know of, breaking off parts affecting traction, the curves boost, a bunch of different things. Now I will note that the R88 does get lower lap times than the PR4, but that doesn't mean that it's completely useless. You can still use this car in free mode time trials and many other things, getting on the map, doing stunts, whatever the case. So for those of you who maybe paid full price for the R88 and are angry about it being on the podium and it's understandable, you know, you paid $3 million for this, you can still take the one you originally purchased and sell it for over $2 million. Again, to avoid confusion I see in the comments sometimes, please note that what you get for the vehicle depends on what you paid for it meaning the podium car will not sell for any money. I'm specifically referring to the R88 that people paid full price for. So, is the R88 worth attempting to win from the podium this week? This is a very big yes in my opinion. Even if it's not the best F1 car, it's still a free $3 million F1 car. You really can't complain about that. That's a very cool thing to have in your garage and drive around. Alright, so to start off with the property discounts, we have 40% off the CEO offices, which is awesome, and 30% off the upgrades and renovations for them as well. So for those of you who don't have a CEO office, this is a property you really need to own as it controls a lot of profitable businesses. So make sure to purchase one if you haven't already. And speaking of some of those businesses, we have 50% off the large CEO crate warehouses. A full large warehouse sells for over $2.2 million, and for those few times they put it on double money, it definitely makes these worth it. Moving on to vehicle discounts, we have 40% off the Flash GT. This sports car used to be the best choice for rally car style races, but ever since the SE Sport came around, it truly dominates it. The main issue with the Flash GT is its slow handling flags. I feel that without that, it will be a lot more competitive with the SE Sport and sports car rally races. Next up, we have 100% off the BF Raptor, making it absolutely free. Now, this vehicle is in the sports class. It's very slow, doesn't drive well, but for free, we literally can't really complain. This is pretty awesome. Moving on to the Southern San Andreas website, we have 100% off the Principe Nemesis. This motorcycle was not very good at all and normally cost only $12,000, but not sure why Rockstar chose to put this one for free, but it's, it's still free either way. Moving on, we have 100% off the normal Hakachu. This bike is actually pretty good in the motorcycles class. It has one of the best top speeds while wheeling. I know the BF400 has, you know, it's the highest top speed while wheeling, but the Hakachu is still really good. Now the handling on the Hakachu is where it really lacks as it takes a while to change direction and the steering response is not that great. But again, a free motorcycle, can't complain too much. Next up, we have 100% off the Hot Rod Blazer. Now this thing is more of a gimmick, in my opinion, and really isn't all that expensive to begin with, but again, it's free. Moving on to the Benny's website, we have 40% off the Itali GTB. This car is in the supercars class, and unfortunately it's way off the pace because of all the newer supercars that have come out over the years, but it's still a fun car to drive and customize, especially with the custom version. Moving on to the Warstock website, we have 35% off the Stromberg. This is a very good vehicle to own free mode and fight against Suppressor Mark II Griefers, as it does have armor and missiles, and of course its submarine function. This is one of the best discounts this week in my opinion, and one you should definitely consider buying. And lastly, we have 40% off the Rocket Voltic. I don't really find this vehicle to be that useful anymore, mainly because of the fact that the Scramjet exists, and it's just better in almost every way. There's really no need to own the Rocket Voltic in my opinion, plus also keep in mind that you need to own a vehicle cargo warehouse in order to even buy it. And that's it for vehicle discounts, I think Rockstar did very well this week, especially with the free vehicles which is quite interesting. Usually they only do this on holidays for one specific vehicle, but I guess we'll see if they continue this trend of random free vehicles every week. 
As for free logins, just for logging in this week, you can get this Coil USA t-shirt for free, which is pretty cool. Moving on to the triple money stuff, we have a triple money NRP on the Associate Bodyguard Salary. Now the payout is still pretty bad to begin with, but hopefully this helps out a little with friends who help you either in your CEO or motorcycle club. We also have triple money NRP on all parachuting jobs. Now I haven't done one of these in years, but I might as well give it a shot later this week. I can barely even remember these, but I don't think they were that much fun. But anyways, as far as double money, we have double money in RP on the seven open wheel races that currently exist in the game. Last time I did triple money in RP on this and the payouts were insane. On double it's decent, but definitely not as good as triple. And lastly, we have double money in RP on VIP work and challenges, which is awesome. So for those of you who grind Headhunter and Sightseer while running your businesses, now you can make a lot more of a profit. Moving on to Twitch Prime discounts for Twitch Prime members only. I'll leave instructions in the pinned comment on how to become a Twitch Prime member if you aren't one already. So we have 80% off the Molotov, probably one of the coolest jets in the game. Not really the best for dogfighting, but still a good looking plane with great customization. Keep in mind that you need to own a hangar in order to purchase it. And lastly, we have 70% off the Mamba. This car is in the Sports Classics class and is a ton of fun to mess around with and drive, but it's not the best or even close to the best in the class for racing due to its handling. Also, don't forget guys, you get a free $200,000 gift just for logging in this week. Again, these two discounts and this bonus free money are for Twitch Prime members only. And lastly, of course, we have the RC Bandito Time Trial Little Soul Park. This week's normal time trial is Power Station. I highly recommend a fast bike such as the Hakachu Drag or Shotaro for this, or another bike doing wheelies such as the Batty 801, or even the free regular Hakachu this week. And of course, you can also use a fast car such as the Pariah or the Vesta 8 to complete this time trial. Now, there is a specific shortcut you need to take for that time trial cutting through a mountain towards the end. If you don't know what I'm talking about, stay tuned for my time trial guide video I post every Friday. And this week's premium race is a supercar race, Senora Freeway. I highly recommend it's a Veste 8 for that one, but it is also very competitive in the Emirates and the Krieger. Anyways guys, hope this was helpful. This fun week is mainly themed around F1 cars and CEOs, which is quite interesting. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one.